Hi and welcome back to Arun by Inside Learning Hub. This is Sumit Kumar Chaudhary and you are watching Manual Testing Series. We will continue discuss on software testing methodology and today's topic is white box testing. So let's begin. White box testing is a form of application testing that provide the tester with complete knowledge of the application being tested including access the source code and design documents this in depth vis uh, visibility makes it possible for each testing and identify issues that are invisible to gray uh, and black box testing so what does a uh, white box testing focus on White box testing takes advantage of extensive knowledge of an application's internal to develop highly targeted test cases. Examples of a uh, test that might be performed during white box testing include path checking. So, white box testing uh, can be used to explore the various execution path within an application to ensure that all conditional statement are correct and necessary and effective and second is output validation so output validation uh, the enumerate the various potential input to a function function and ensure that each process the expected result second is security testing so testing code analysis and other white box testing technique are used to identify potential vulnerability within an application and validate that it follows secure development as practice next is loop testing test the loop within an application to ensure that are correct effect efficient and properly manage the variable within their scope and last is data flow testing so data flow testing tracks variable throughout the execution path of a program to ensure that variable are declared initialize use and properly manipulate so by a type of white box testing are unit testing is designed to ensure that each component or function of an application work properly this help to ensure that the application meet design requirement throughout the development process and second is integration testing integration testing focus on the interface between the various component within an application perform after unit testing it ensure that not only does each component work well in isolation but also that they can work together effectively and next is regression testing so regression testing ch changes can break things within an application so regression testing ensure that the code still passes ex existing test case after functionality or security update are made in application so let's discuss about the white box testing techniques one of the main advantage of the white box testing is that it makes it possible to ensure that every aspect of an application is tested to to achieve full code coverage white box testing can use the following testing statement coverage so a statement coverage testing ensure that every line of code within an application is tested by at least one test case statement coverage testing 
can help to identify if portion of the code are unused or unreachable, which can be caused by programming error, update, etc. Identify this that code enable a developer to fix incorrect conditional statement or remove a redundant code to improve application performance and security. Branch coverage. So, conditional statement create branches within an application's execution code as different input can follow different execution path. Branch coverage testing ensure that every branch within an application is covered by unit testing. This ensure that even little used code path are properly validated. And last is path coverage. An execution path describes the sequence of instruction that can be executed from when an application starts to where it determines. Path coverage testing ensures that every execution path through an application is covered by the use case. This can help to ensure that all execution paths are functional efficient and necessary. I hope you understand the concept and like the video. To show your feedback, please like the video and share it with your network.